Hi, my name is Mike. I retired from the Air Force after 23 years of service. As a diehard Republican since 1981, it seems to be hard for me to vote for Biden in November, but it's going to be easy. I truly feel I have no choice. For the second election in a row, I will do what's best for this country. And that means having someone other than Trump in that office. I voted against him then, and I'll vote against him now. I have several problems with him. The man just can't stop lying, name-calling, making things up, deflecting blame, and twisting facts for his own purpose. Don't even get me started on the ignorant things that often come out of his mouth. Does injecting disinfectant ring a bell? How do his followers manage to ignore it all? It's amazing. I don't trust anything the man says or does. I want a leader, someone willing to take responsibility when things go wrong. I still remember watching him at one of the press conferences close to the beginning of all the lockdowns, whining that, you know, it's my responsibility. If you're the leader and your people mess up, then hell yes, it's your responsibility. Most importantly, I want a president who strives to bring the country together as one people during a crisis, not someone who's intent on tearing it to pieces. What was he thinking attacking state and local governments just because they had democratic leaders? These were people doing their best to lead with limited resources, thanks in large part to the federal governments, and by that I mean the president, lack of guidance or assistance. Instead of attacking them, he should have been doing his best to bring us together as a nation, working together as one to beat COVID. But no, he thought encouraging rallies against business closures and downplaying the need to wear masks was a great idea. How many are dead thanks to his actions? Talk about irresponsible. A real leader would have been the example for his citizens by wearing a mask as recommended by his own medical advisors. He would have strictly adhered to social distancing and told the truth to the American citizens, encouraging them to take proper precautions. What I saw was a megalomaniac who was too proud to do what he knew was right, failing at leadership and not leading by example. The pandemic was the perfect opportunity for Trump to grab the reins of control and shine like the sun. Instead, he managed to shine a little less brightly than a black hole. Please vote to bring back a united United States of America. Vote Biden. Thank you.